President Irfan Ali announced that Ghana will become the first country in the world to implement a fully standardized border-to-border -border national biodiversity monitoring system by 2030. He made this disclosure on the final indoor session of the Global Diversity Summit, which concluded at the Artichon Conference Center on Thursday. Ghana has announced the launch of the National Biodiversity Management Monitoring Strategy. Ghana will implement a fully standardized border-to-border biodiversity monitoring to support the effective valuation of Guyana's greatest asset. The National Biodiversity Information System, which was launched during the summit, will gather and analyze data on the country's plants, animals, and ecosystems to help guide decisions and policies that support sustainable development and conservation. We want a transparent system, a system in which there is measurement and evaluation, and a system, a system in which there is accountability. According to President Ali, he stated that the initiative shows Ghana's commitment to protecting the environment and will create a new global standard for biodiversity accountability at the national level. This groundbreaking effort, catalyzed by our convening this week, all of us convening this week at the inaugural Global Biodiversity Alliance Summit, will set a new global benchmark for national scale biodiversity accountability. Moreover, the government on Thursday signed a letter of intent with Sylvania, a global natural capital investment platform to develop innovative methods for valuing and financing biodiversity. This agreement was established on day two of the just concluded Alliance Summit involving government officials, indigenous peoples, biodiversity experts and private sector leaders to enhance ecosystem protection. The country has secured payments for forest climate services, including partnership with Norway that led the sale of red plus carbon credits to companies like Apple and Hess Corporation. Sylvania, a 500 million investment platform launched by Mercuria, invests in nature-based solutions across Latin America, Africa, Europe and Asia, focusing on ecosystem restoration. Antonio Day reporting for the HGP Nightly News.